It's qualifying here at the resplendent Monte Carlo Monaco for what is always a special event for both drivers and teams. Yo, JD here to this, and as you can see, we're racing against pole around here. Monaco here today, so as always, before starting lap, getting DRS as you can. But this first corner, we'll be breaking just before the 2015 banner above the track. Go down to third gear, try and do a slow in, fast out approach for this corner. As you go up to the top of the hill, I keep it in sixth gear just before we go down three gears. As soon as the car's straight, try and hit both of these apexes so the first one, the second one, the third gear. And then for this next right hander, swing it out to the right just for the black box. That's your turning in point in second gear. Going down to this hairpin, I leave it in second gear. As you go past the black box, try and do a relatively late apex in first gear. As you hit the yellow part of the track, that's your turning point in second gear once again. And just for the black box once again, second gear. Try and get a really good exit off this time, which is very, very important. And you will be looking for the 100 meter board at the right hand side of the track. So not this one, that one there. We want to go to the second gear, try and really attack these apexes because you can really make up a lot of time through here. On the right hand side, the 100 meter board, that's your turning in point in fourth gear, short shift into fifth. Go flat out first, fast left right, as soon as the car's straight, go down to second gear. Try and get a really aggressive entry onto this corner. Just before the shadow, you want to go down to the second gear once again. Just before the tree, that's your second gear. DRS as you can, and that's the lap of Monaco. And it was a pretty busy lap, and we have to see if we can beat Ricardo's 13.6, but we've managed to do 14.0. Um, considering <laughs> the tyres I was on as well, and the Red Bull in this game, um, I felt it was a pretty good lap. So hopefully you've learned something there. It's uh, pretty brizzy for references. Most of the time, I just use feeling um, rather than references um, driving around this track. But certainly, you can see here today, I'm um, using quite high, high aerodynamics. A um, bit different from 2 1 and 1 1 as usual. But for the rest of the setup, um, pretty similar to what it usually is. Um, so, as always, uh, thank you so much for watching. Also, there's a closed beta um, that's going on at the moment. There's going to be a link in the description below how you can actually sign up for that in F1 2016. So, the more people can join that, the better. Next track is Canada, so I hope you enjoy that and enjoy the race today. Cheers.